Hi, good day. My name is Raquel J. Baluan and I am from Group 3. The topic that I will show you and I will report you is all about the kinds of tournament on basketball. There are five kinds of tournament in basketball. It is the single elimination, double elimination, multi level, the straight round robin, and the round robin double split. And I will show you and I will explain and we will identify the kinds of tournament on basketball. So first, we explain and we identify what is single elimination. Single elimination. The greatest appeal of the single elimination tournament is its simplicity. Losers are eliminated and winners advance to the next round until one contestant remains the tournament champion. The single elimination tourney is available when the number of number is large, time is short, and the number of location is limited of all tournaments. This one requires the fewest game for matches. However, half the participants are eliminated after one game and only a quarter of the participants remain after the second round. When more extensive participation is important and more location and time are available, a single elimination tournament is probably not your best choice. Yes, a single elimination format is the simplest but the other tournaments described in this manual are also easy to organize. So the simplicity of single elimination is not a significant factor in this favor. Advantage, a quickest method of determining a winner. This advantage provides the fewest opportunity for a contestant to play. The total number of games be played can be figured by subtracting one for more number of entries. Example, 16 entries, 16 minus 1 equals 15 games. Double elimination is designed to address the two problems inherent in the single elimination tournament. In other words, our strength for a double elimination. Pample of problem number 1 and number 2. Often are overrated because of those strength, have weaknesses and there are good alternative major difficulties the second and third seeded player play many games, particularly in the final rounds of the tournaments. It's take many rounds to complete. Often does not use available areas efficiently. For example, it's a, a tournament consists of nine entries and there are four playing areas available in double elimination tournament takes seven rounds to complete. Multi-level is similar to single elimination tournament in the fact at the top level they are the same. However, in this multi level, a player is not eliminated following a loss but simple move down one or more level to play into the constellation round. This downward movement continues until no other chance remains. One of the result approach is that all players play about the same under of games. Another benefit is that each around the player are more likely to encounter others of their caliber. In the final round of play, in single and double elimination tournament, there are only one or two playing areas in use. This is not the case in a multi-level tournament. As a result, when sufficient playing areas are available, the multi-level tournament takes the same time to complete as a single elimination tournament in half the time of double elimination tournament. The multi-level tournament is an excellent choice when equality in number of games played in closely in contestant matches are important consideration. Time is limited. Knowledge of a third and subsequent final placement into a crucial. Most useful in physical education classes or intramurals or recreational settings where eliminating players under cerebral and final stat are of little significance. Round Robin. Each entry plays all other entries in their leagues at least once. Wins and losses do not affect a participation. Winner determines from win or loss per percentage. Round robin consists all of individuals or teams playing each entry an equal number of times. When there are more entries and the games take longer to complete, as in hockey, football, or basketball, then a round robin schedule is best suited for league plays. In this case, one time through a round robin provide the league schedule in its time permit. You could provide a home and away schedule simply by going through the round robin schedule twice round robin and round robin split tournaments have fixed kit schedules all entries know exactly who they place and what time they play them for some advantage to entries in preparing for the tournaments in upcoming games 
seeding does not affect the outcome because the cumulative result of all games played determines final standings. When the number of entries are few and games are played quickly, as in a table tennis, badminton, or volleyball, this type of format is effective for a one-day tournament. The round-robin format is not suitable for all situations because all entries play each other. A round-robin format is problematic when the number of entries is high. Example, a tournament with 32 entries would take 496 games to complete using a round-robin. This compares with 62 games in the double elimination and only 31 in single elimination. Also, when there is considerable discrepancy is caliber of play may prove unsatisfactory to all involved in this contest. Round Robin Tournament Advantage and Disadvantage provide an equal number of games for all teams. Disadvantage is take a great deal of time to complete if there are seven teams competing. A Round Robin Tournaments provide the opportunity for a number of teams in a tournament to play against come another, once single round robin, twice double round robin, etc. That determine the number of round to be played follow the formula odd number of team is equals to n even number of team is n minus 1 round robin double split when a round robin format is desirable but the number of entries is too large splitting the entries into two pools in a practical solution following the play within the pools only the top two entries for each pool participate in place of determining the final top standing of use benefit is that the number of game is halves drawback is that proper seeding become important for example if the top three seed are placed into one pool and only the top two for each pool advance to the play off then if entries perform consistent with their seeding the third seed cannot play in the playoffs commonly used for league play you could split the league into two pole of division with the place of bringing together the top two teams for each other division with the playoffs bringing together the top two teams for each division to decide final standings Round Robin Advantages and Disadvantages Popularity, easily organized and administered, no game time in advance, maximum participation, rank entries at end, effective for outdoor, socialized due to extended season, time consuming, facility extensive, high forfeit rate Y, long season with two or more leagues for true champion, possibility of leagues ending and ties.